What the hell is even that? Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Today, me and my boy were on our way to work, and we started talking about this one YouTuber called Kevin Leonardo, who, if you don't know who that is, good for you. Because this man has no chill. His YouTube channel just consists of videos of him showing his dick, balls, and asshole to the camera. We got videos such as removing butt hairs using nair cream, a visual guide. And the title of that video is very true. You get a very visual guide of his asshole to the camera. Same thing goes for trimming pubes and testicles, a visual guide. You just see his dick and balls. And the worst part is, his entire channel is like that. And if you're wondering how his channel has not been taken down, well, it's because technically all these videos are educational. Technically. Even though they break every single rule in YouTube's TOS, that shit I find really whack. But anyways, my boy, whose name is also Kevin, kinda funny, huh? Let me just give him a shout out real quick. If you want to see some creatively funny videos, or some funny shorts, go sub to Unlimited Kev. He's a funny guy, and he's a lot cooler than the Kevin I'm talking about in this video. You know, the one that shows his asshole, dick, and balls to the camera. And apparently also does blackface. Cause my boy Unlimited Kev was telling me about, hey, you know this dude actually made a video of himself doing blackface? And I'm just there like, what the fuck? So now we're going to give this video a watch, and holy fucking shit, he's actually doing blackface. I gotta say, I'm not really too surprised. Cause, well, he shows his asshole to the camera, so I don't think this man has any shame at all. Anyways, let's give this a watch. The blacks of the internet are currently very mad because- Alright, um, not even 10 seconds into the video, and he said something crazy. How do you just say something like, the blacks of the internet? Like, I don't know, this dude's crazy. Anyways, he's just talking about like, oh, Euphoria just came out with their new darkest foundation, and he's gonna give it a try. So let's just skip to that part. Ooh, okay, ow. Not ow, my bad, I don't know why I said ow. Two pumps, clean brush. Oh my god, I feel so cool. I feel like a content creator in makeup. Wow, okay. This already looks kind of crazy. <laughs> Oh my. Crazy is an understatement. It looks very dark. All right, now half of his face is black. Now you would think he would stop right there and then, cause he's already cutting it pretty close. But as you can see in the thumbnail, well, he went the full mile. But let's finish the rest of my face. Two more pumps, I think. Alright, so this is the darkest shade of the Euphoria Foundation on my face, and it looks very, very black. Like, I feel like the darkest of black people would get accused of cultural appropriation just because this is literally so dark. I don't know anyone in real life that looks this black. The darkest of black people would get accused of cultural appropriation is a crazy statement when you as not a black person puts that all over your face. Essentially doing blackface, that is what you are doing. Brother, just admit it, you're doing blackface just to get views. Cause in the end of the day, Kevin Leonardo is not a black person, nor is he a makeup influencer, and he even said this. Now, I personally don't wear makeup, but I love like online beauty scandals. This dude doesn't even wear makeup. He knows nothing about makeup. And I know that cause I watched the video and he was basically just saying a bunch of nonsense. Like, I feel like I don't really know what to say because I feel like my undertones are coming out like I do feel like my warmness is coming out and like they did market this as like a deep neutral so like maybe my like warmness is coming out through the neutral because as you can see well I also don't know anything about makeup but it kind of just sounded like he was saying some bullshit I don't know what I do know is this dude does not have any qualifications to be doing this so, why in hell would he be giving his input on this makeup in the first place? And I got an easy answer for all of this. It's all for views. That's what his entire channel is. He shows his asshole for views. 
He shows his balls for views, he shows his penis for views, he says crazy shit for views, and now he's doing blackface reviews. This dude should not have a YouTube channel anymore, because first of all, the type of content he usually makes is basically just porn. I don't think porn should be on YouTube, and he always says some crazy shit and does dumb shit like blackface, which definitely should not be on YouTube. And you know what I find the funniest part about this all? In his video of him doing blackface, he does something in a way of, I guess, trying to justify that video being educational. He removes the foundation off half his face, and uses another foundation to try and compare the two. And I guess that must make it more educational in the eyes of YouTube or something. This might be like a true inclusive like dark shade that black people just absolutely love. Let's just put on like four pumps, I guess. Um, okay, one, two, three, four. Ooh, that's spilling. So let's do this. Okay, so on this side is the darkest shade of the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Foundation, and on this side is the darkest shade of the Euphoria Foundation. Yeah, he looks like this, and uh, uh, what the fuck? Not only did he do blackface, now he's doing two different shades of blackface. Like, what the fuck? I don't know, I just find it funny how Kevin Leonardo can just show his asshole, dick, and balls to the camera, and even do blackface, and still have a channel, and have his videos monetized, while other YouTubers who just curse a little bit too much just have their videos demonetized. I just don't think that's right. The rules should apply to everybody, even the people that show their asshole, dick, balls, and do blackface on the camera. Is that too much to ask? I don't know. Anyways, I think that's gonna be it for me today. Hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like and subscribe, I'd appreciate it. Have a good rest of your day, drink some water, adios and bye bye